guys. Well, here's my two, yep, 2019 Les Paul Classic. Uh, let me mute the uh, Yamaha TGR10X for now. Get a good look at this. I've been fighting with OBS trying to record something for the last two days. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to use different settings on OBS because I use I'm using a different a video editor for the last couple months, month or so. Learn how to use it. It's really capable. I mean, really a high-end uh, video editor. I'm using the Vichy Resolve. And I use OBS to do my recordings here. So I import those videos into OBS. I mean, I'm sorry, I import the OBS video files into DaVinci, but DaVinci Resolve, it, it, there's issues with uh, recorded videos from OBS. And so I'm using all these settings and different things. And so, so I'm using these different settings. It seems like it's working, except for my audio wouldn't work. I couldn't get any proper sound in it. It just killed my audio. And I did everything to get it back. It just it was not right. So I finally uh, I reset I, I reset OBS. So even that, after I did that, it took a little while. And there's an auto configuration OBS. OBS. So I let it do that. And it's actually using, I got a built in, well, I got a laptop, but it's got a dedicated built in NVIDIA 2 gig, two gigabyte car, uh, video uh, graphics adapter built in. And you need, actually, for DaVinci Resolve, you need a high-end computer. This is an i7, but you really need, like, a probably 4 to 8 gigabyte video card. And, uh, but, you know, you can't replace them with a laptop. But for basic stuff, DaVinci Resolve is okay. But if you want to use Fusion, which is, which is uh, their animated composite video uh, effects where you can do animated video, all kinds of oh, really cool stuff, in it. but you need a high end computer and a lot of RAM, and which I just got 16, so I haven't messed with that. But there's this, but for doing what I've been doing, and it's a lot better than using Shotcut like I was, there's a lot of stuff you can do in it. But like I said, I was getting problems with uh, the video files where you part, like, you know, it, it, halfway through a video, it's fine, then it's part of it's corrupted or you know, it's no media. And get this error and DaVinci Resolve. So using the settings I had, the, they worked fine, but it messed up my audio. But I, anyway, like I said, I reset it, and I let I let um, OBS do this auto configuration thing, and then I started putting my audio. You know, I'm using my webcam mic. I know it's not that good, not good, very good at all, and uh, just for convenience. And, and uh, anyway, knock on wood, I think I got it. So. I'm using um, my THR-10X, as you can see right there, and, you know, I thought I was having, I noticed a lot of noise, but I, and with all my guitars, I'm getting all this, you know, depending what effect I'm using on, on uh, THR-10X, but it's got a compressor, like a, a noise gate, so I can knock the noise down, and I think in my, you know, I use the, my Boss Katana mostly, and it's got a, a noise suppressor in there, you know, when I'm using the software. And that's, but that's the one all the time. You know, I got to back it off sometimes. Uh, so anyway, I so said I'm going to play a little bit because I'm so exhausted. And uh, I came, I left work early today. It wasn't feeling so hot. But anyway, so, oh yeah, by the way, I'm almost down 30 pounds. And Wednesday will be nine weeks. Almost 30 pounds. I went from 46 to 42. Still got a Still need to lose 40 more pounds, but I'm getting there. Anyway, so let's see if we can play something. I'm going to mute the webcam mic so you don't pick up, um, well, you know, like, well, uh, this. Yeah. All right, so. Alright, and I'm just going to see, and you might be able to see what I'm changing the effects to. I'll try to do some clean sounds and what have you, so. Alright, here it goes. And I'm, and i got to get used to this guitar. I'm not used to this guitar. i got to get used to it. Um, I do like the wider, wider slim taper fretboard, but. Alright, let's see. Let me mic. 
Let me mute this, and here we go.
there you have it. Uh, hopefully this video comes out okay. Um, this thing is just, you know, this this has the push-pull pots on the volume and the tone. I don't they split the coil and one's phasing and I gotta learn all that. But I'm getting all these sounds out of without doing any of that. This thing is just incredible. Uh, I'm not getting this kind of sound out of anything. And I'm just going through this THR 10X and if I had a tube amp, oh my god. Do I see a tube amp in the future? Nah. I don't think. Because I can't use headphones with a tube amp, I don't think. Uh, maybe you can. But uh, that's kind of defeating its purpose. Although the Line 6 Helix is kind of very appealing to me. But I need to practice with this to get good. Um, this is going to be what they call my daily driver for, for a long while. Um, this thing, it just, it's just incredible. I just like the tunes. Um, and like I said, it's, it's, it's got some weight to it, but it's not like it's, it doesn't bother me. You know, I sit down, so it doesn't bother me. But it might be, it might be the heaviest guitar I have. So, okay guys, cross your fingers, this video came out. See y'all later.